Hello everybody, it's Scott Omato. In this video, I'm going to show you how to fix a long-standing problem that I've had with the Twitch launcher in not being able to play 113 and above on the Mac. Okay, this is probably only a Mac thing. I've tried to play it on PC and it works okay. So it must be a Mac thing. All right, but... I play multi MC so I could get around it. I didn't really worry about it, but today I just decided, all right, I'm going to try to fix this. And so I do have a fix. I don't know all the consequences of it, but everything seems to be fine. Uh, but I'll show you how to make backups and stuff like that. Just in case. All right. It's, it's, well, let me just go through it. All right. So let's create a custom profile here. And then from the list, you know, we're able to choose our versions. Now it does it all the way from 113 and above, uh, but I'll use 1.13.2. All right. And so we'll just like put in test 113.2 and we'll create the profile. There's a mod loader thing and it's empty. So I don't know if they'll eventually have rift in there or whatever. All right. So here, everything's good. That appears except you push play okay and the launcher comes up now pay attention that this is launcher version 1.6.61 guys that's the problem this is an old version of the launcher number one that's why you're seeing all this new stuff on here this actually comes from a tumblr page um, and that's why you always see minecraft 1.1.2 released you know because it's old old news the new launcher of course is this version 2 1 right here and it looks like this okay now on windows you have the option i think to actually choose that launcher under your minecraft settings here uh there is an option that is for uh so just right there for launch method native launcher or jar launcher you don't have that choice on Mac. This is grayed out. There's nothing you can do about it. And you, you know, you don't really want that launcher anyway. So the thing is, is that what we want to do is we want to update this launcher. Let, let me again go, go ahead and show you what happens. So if I push play, nothing happens. Nothing. Okay. But something is happening if you look at the launcher log. And it's going to tell you right here. An update to your launcher is available and is required to play 1.13.2. Please restart your launcher. Okay, so it's telling you there's an update to the launcher. Uh, they're probably talking about one, you know, the two version, but there is an update for this 1.6.91. Now, the problem is they've removed it, all traces of it, and, and I'll maybe make a video about that from the Mojang site okay you can't go to like the alternative launcher method that you used to be able to do to get the old versions and stuff all right that, that's not there anymore so I will put in a link that is from the Mojang site that pulls it down pulls down this version of the 1.6.91 that's what we need that version will uh do will work for uh, 1.13.2. Now, 1.14, uh, who knows? Who knows? I don't, I don't know. But, okay, when you pull it down, when you use the link I give you, you will get this launcher.jar.1.6.91.lzma. LZMA is a compression format, okay? Uh, archive won't do it. So you're going to have to have another type of compression one. I use the unarchiver on the Mac for that purpose. Okay. I'll leave a link in the description. Uh, there's also another one called Kekka, but uh, the unarchiver will work for these compressions. So basically you need to decompress that. Okay. And it'll put it wherever it puts it for me. It puts it here at the top of the list. It'll still have that extension of 1.6.1, and you just need to delete that last part right there to make it a jar. It'll ask you, do you want to? And you say, yes, use jar. All right, there it is, right there. Now, what we've got to do, there's 
there's a couple things. All right, first of all, go to your Twitch menu here and choose About Twitch, okay? And here is a link to the client folder, okay, inside of there. Now this is all just safety stuff. It may not make a difference at the end of the day or, or whatever. But this takes you to the curse folder in application support on your Mac. This is where all of your curse stuff is. So, you know, your curse logs and uh, different different things are there, all right? Databases, there, there's a lot of stuff, all right? You normally don't want to do anything in this folder or touch it. There's the updater and stuff like that. Okay, now what you do want to do is just go ahead and back up this folder. Okay, just back it up. Just just compress it and back it up. Just in case something goes wrong, you know, you'll have it. You'll have what you did before. Okay, now I don't think much can go wrong, um, but we're going to see if I can reproduce uh, uh, some things that did happen. Okay. Uh, a message. I don't know if I'll get the message since I actually am trying to reproduce what I already have done. All right. But we that's how you get to that folder. All right. And then this, of course, this will tell you if the current version of Twitch that I'm doing because things may have changed between the, this video. But it's been a long time. 113 has been out a while. Okay. And they have not updated this. So. All right, now what you want to do is you want to, the easiest way is you just go to this, you know, more three dots button up here and choose open folder, okay? And it's going to take you to the folder for uh, your Twitch instance. And then you go up to the curse folder. Curse folder's in your documents on the Mac, guys. That's where it is. Documents, curse, and then this is it. So under the Minecraft folder, right there, Go down and there's going to be a folder called install. Okay, install. And then inside of that, there's going to be a folder called game. All right. Now game is where the launcher is. This is the launcher right here. All right. And this is the new one. Okay. That I put. So that launcher that I just made launcher.jar. Don't, don't replace this old one. Just rename it. Just rename it launcher. Um, old or original or whatever old and then I changed the extension just so there is no doubt about it to BAK just which means backup basically okay and then this is launcher new that's that one I just did the way that I showed you okay and launcher dot jar like that okay now let me show you what happens if you make a mistake in in the um, spelling or, or the punctuation or something like that. Okay, so basically we quit Twitch. All right, and then we open Twitch back up. And I'm see if I can reproduce what happened before. Okay, so let that open for a second. Then we go to mods and we go to Minecraft. Yeah, it'll do this screen that says, let's play Minecraft. It looks like we're missing a few pieces, you know, install stuff. I haven't pushed advanced. I may play with that kind of stuff later, but it's not advisable for me to do it on camera for this kind of thing. That just means it can't find the launcher here. So like I said, this is the new launcher 1.6.91. All right, so let's open Twitch again, go to there, and we'll see if it gives me a message it gave me before. Before it's, it said, looks like you're using an older launcher, and do you want to change the settings, change your settings? And I had to say yes to that. Let's see if this does that or if it's already changed its needed settings. I did move back and forth to test them. Okay, I didn't get that message, I don't think. But you will get a message on the screen. Yeah, here it is. So you do get it. All right, it says, it looks like you've used a newer launcher than this one. If you go back to using this one, we'll reset your configuration. Now, this is an actually a newer one than what they had, but whatever, they're confused by that. 
So this is where I say, I'm sure reset my settings. Okay. I'm not sure what settings they reset, but they reset something. And obviously they reset your, your uh, login and stuff like that. Okay. I, I can see that it's happening. So let me go ahead guys and log in real quick and I'll be right back with you. Okay guys, so I just logged in, gave it the, my credentials, and so we logged in. All right, so here we are, and you can see at the top, Minecraft Launcher 1.6.91. Now don't get confused because 1.6.61, you know, and 1.6.91 are very similar, but this is 9.1, all right? So, play. Remember, we're launching 1.13.2. Okay, now otherwise the launcher shouldn't care. Now, you know, it, it shouldn't care about, it should be able to play all of your other profiles and 1.12.2 and every old, uh, old thing that you've got. It just couldn't play the newest versions of Minecraft, but now it can. Okay. So we have apparently fixed it, guys. It seems to be fixed, okay? So, you know, if we went through and browsed our mod packs and got another mod pack and stuff, we should be able to play it, all right? But if something does happen to go amiss, then you have a backup of that and just keep the backup around until you feel comfortable that, you know, everything's good and then delete that. And then you always do remember have your backup in here so you could just roll back to that other uh old one all right so anyway guys thank goodness we fixed it we can now play 113 in twitch and twitch people what is up do you hate mac users or what guys gone through a lot of stuff with you <laughs> really with different bugs and all kinds of craziness but okay okay they're smarter than they are, at least temporarily. So, I hope you enjoyed this video. Guys, please leave a like. A like means so much, and it's so easy for you to do, guys. It's so easy, and yet, it just makes my day. So, I do appreciate you watching. Mac users, this is for you. You know, so take care. Scott Omano, have a great day. Bye-bye.